Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I would love to welcome you in the Snow IO second video. In the first video I explained it to you what Snow IO or Snowio actually is. We created an account and now we are about to push through the more exciting part I would say and actually sneaking into the Snow IO. We created an account and uh, waited uh, for approximately 20 minutes to get our invitation or unlocking our account to use. So I finished a previous video there and this is a new one. This is a fresh start about how we can easily work in Snow.io. So this is the confirmation uh, account or confirmation link that uh, we waited for, obviously. There's some warning from my provider. And here we are. This is the Snow IO, as you probably thought. Uh, it's very beautiful UI. I have no complaints against the Snow IO. It's beautiful, it's easy to read. So let's now proceed. So, company name, let's go with uh, Tao Commerce. Company size. 1 to 10. What's your occupation? Sales business, uh, lead generation, uh, inbound email marketing. What are your main goals with Snow.io? Find leads. Oh, you can go with more. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, all of those are okay. And also try out Snow.io and go to your account. So here we have 11 steps of step by step actually proceeding to Snow IO as it actually is. We can go through them. Let's get started. Prospects and companies, email finder, email verifier, email warm up, drip campaigns, sales CRM, extensions, also integrations, my account, and then uh, knowledge base. Yeah, knowledge base. It's it's okay. We can definitely work with that. Don't worry about it. So what we are about to do here. First of all, we have some prospects. Install email finder extension. This is beautiful thing to have. So we are going to install it uh, step by step. Previously, we toyed around with Hunter EO, Uplead, and also Honeybook. All of those had these extensions. So those I strongly recommend you using. It's very easy to get. You just get to your Chrome Web Store and add the Chrome and add the extension. It's not a big problem. It's not a big uh, workload on you or on anyone. It's very, very easy to do. You don't have to install it. You don't have to call your IT guy to do it for you. You just click twice and here you are. If you're asking where you can find the Snow IO plugin or this type of extension, it's in top right corner. As you can see on the right side, we have these three dots that will come handy when we want to get rid of that uh, uh, get rid of that extension if you are not satisfied with Snow.io but I don't find the reason why you should not be we can easily go uh, through this one and uh, yeah then we go more and more into exploring then you have your account then we have uh, tabs and then there is this puzzle looking icon and here you will find email finder by snow.io and here we are in here all domains emails as you can see are in here prospects and stuff like that we all view all 122 results here you can edit prospect for example, if we want to go and uh, 
enter something or some site that is, for example, I don't know, I'm a gamer, I'm playing uh, World of Warcraft, so maybe this website and we want to check it out. We just click on the extension and click in here. And as you can see, there are no emails found, no prospects. Maybe we should go to something more. Okay, Netflix. Netflix browse. Or let's go with Twitch. Okay, I have this guy that I'm watching. I don't really want to. Okay. And we're going to click on the extension. And with Twitch, you see it will show us the prospect. Like uh, peering, Twitch, DMCA, legal Twitch, partner help. And this can do on all of the websites that are, I believe, uh, bigger. Head of development, as you can see, with prospects, it will search for Facebook, LinkedIn, and uh, Twitter accounts. And just like that, if we go to any other website, it will just give us those leads, and you can easily save them and use them later. So this ex extension, I would say, it's crucial to have if you want to utilize Snow.io to its best. So what we have here next, collect and reach target prospect in bulk, upload your own prospect list, find company employee email contact and find company prospect with contact. You can easily watch the video how to do and we can just go to database, database search and search for, for all the links and all the prospects that we can for example email search first name last name company domain name and they will find an email for you this is the great tool for headhunters great tool for probably all of you who is like looking for more leads and uh, yeah stuff like that you can easily get advantage from your from your competitors by using single use of this uh, snow io search engine i would love to say that um, we are already inside of the snow io and i haven't really have to address a credit card for the for this free trial and it works perfectly fine so their competitors, Applead, uh, they really need to have your credit card information added. So, yeah, bummers, right? But don't worry, we will prevail and we will get all that we, that we need. So, what's next? We have verify emails. Type an email for verification. For example, I can write down my own email and verify it. And yeah, it's green. The email address is valid. Email format is valid. Domain isn't disposable. Domain is free mail. The email address isn't gibberish. A lot of features are quite uh, similar, I would say, with uh, hunter.io. But, uh, yeah, like if it's something's good, then why would you have to like choose a different approach? If it works, it works. I mean, then uh, let's explore it next. Email warm ups warm up my email everything you need to warm up you can easily add your main mailbox add a new mailbox gmail uh, okay you can add your email into it allow it and basically we just made our first integration with this and uh, just like the uh, 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 
yeah, let's, I'm not, I don't really want to do that with an email, but easily you can use your everyday email. If you're a smaller company, we are not only talking enterprise here. We are, look, uh, we are looking for smaller levels of, of companies or maybe even freelancers. If you have you, your own shop, maybe, I don't know, you're hiring or you are, you have like few people underneath you and you need to look for a clues. This is a perfect, perfect example, perfect way how we can do that. Email drip campaigns. Yeah, I want to leave this one. Build my first campaign. And here is where the fun starts. Same as at Hunter IO, we are going to build my first campaign. So drop uh, elements uh, here to buy. So both <laughs> to build email. Just like that. Yeah, this is really nice. Then we can add a trigger. <laughs> this is very nice. Okay. You can add a set a trigger, set a waiting time. If yes or no, okay, we can easily how we can ah very nice and go. No waiting time. Okay. And just like that, we build ourselves a little campaign. For some of you, this may be a little bit confusing since you are building it literally like building it. But we can go just next. Please do follow the at subject line. Okay. Okay, we have to do it like this. Okay, so I thought it's in prospect, but uh, okay, start is okay. Subject line, write something uh, attention grabbing, sale here. We want to write down type or past your, what we want to say, okay. And let's check if we can add, wow, we can add files in free version. That's great. Okay, so first, email is here. Trigger. Wait up one hour. Open email. Click on link. Booked email. Uh, okay, this is not what we wanted. Open the email. Okay. And goal. Goal name. We can add a goal name. New customer. Attracted. Okay. Just like that, and we can proceed into prospect. List the name, new prospect uh, list. So maybe uh, we want to go with uh, a level of, uh, on based on the year. For example, we are we want to attract people from in their active working years from 27, 28 to maybe 60. And this can be your like prospect. If a prospect has multiple email addresses sent to all emails, first email, uh, okay. Let's go like this, this. Do not email a list name. Okay, this is a list for a person or a set of people who are not, uh, who, who you don't really want to send this email to. So if you have maybe a colleagues in or some guys you don't really want to reach out to, this is a perfect way how not to mess that up. And hit next. Choose a prospector list. Okay, prospector list, new prospector list. We can start with a new one. And then, yeah, upgrade notifications for a plan. So if someone open our email, we will know how does it look? We can preview it. This is how it is gonna look. Obviously it's horrendous, but uh, yep. Uh, it's just for the show, proceed anyway. And we already previewed the email. This is a really 
easy way how you can create your campaign it's gonna be beautiful it's gonna be something that nobody has and yeah you can you can toy around with it it's very beautiful and i strongly recommend you using this one for your own business for your own good let's say you want to maybe not use the extension anymore and you want to get rid of it since we have only crm options in here and uh, they are implementing the crm inside so this is your classic crm but most people that i know are not using the snow io as a crm they already have one and then we have extensions and then integrations obviously they are working with uh, zapier but you need to upgrade to premium and then you can just connect with hubspot pipe drive and many many options in here so back to the merit what how we can get rid of the extension if we are not going to use it or uh, you decide not to go with snow io we want to go to the top right corner where are these three little dots click on extensions it's an option somewhere in the middle and manage extensions in here are, are all of my extensions maybe i just showed you how to get rid of the extensions as they are and uh, let's go with email finder but snow io and remove it maybe you have to remove more of them uh, since you didn't know how to get rid of extensions and yeah that's how you are going to remove it that's all folks if you have any types of questions please leave them underneath this video and i'll get back to you in the next one i'm even willing to create another video for you to explain something like that so thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one have a great day and goodbye